Ola. So Pyra and Mithra are probably going to be added in two days because I had a message saying that um, they're going to delete all the replays in two days. And also, the uh, then Sakurai going over the moveset is happening in two days. So I figure, hey, let's go take a look at the, the replays that I've done. Should be fun, right? <laughs> so this is just kind of like a last minute thing. Hence why I'm not in my, my Lucario avatar or something like that. I figure I go chill. Also, it's like 2 in the morning, so... Maybe a little tired. This guy was a little interesting. He was very... Very passive. I'm used to seeing me always be extremely aggressive. What is his me supposed to be, anyways? Oh, I just barely missed it. Oh, he whiffed it. <laughs> He's too short. Also, I'm not really good with the short hop fairing yet. I'm supposed to doing it, do the fair as you're falling. I guess, I think it's probably because like I'm used to like other characters. Like, for Lucario, you kind of want to spam the fair as soon as possible because, like, you can just do fairs back-to-back -back non-stop. Because there's, like, little end lag and it covers a lot of distance. <laughs> I just... My brain did not register that. It's like, did I really catch the read there? I don't remember. <laughs> I wasn't looking thinking about Lucario. Now, one thing I don't know is if this is a three stock or not. I just remember watching this guy, I'm like, what is he doing? <laughs> I think he gets at least one stock off on me. Hmm. Maybe this guy doesn't know how to play me brawler or something. Oh! You did get that though. I'm trying to remember what the- oh yeah, he doesn't have the shot put. Um, I'm not sure how- which one would be better for this. I just know that like the- the, the kick is like something you should never take, but like the, the mock punch and the shot put are very different. I would imagine on Sephiroth... Yeah, probably the, the, the mock punch would probably be better, you know? Because... You get another option. Because um, I don't think you're going to be hitting Sephiroth with the, the shot put. Because his recovery travels pretty quick. Still possible, though. I love doing that too much, and as you can see, it was not safe. I'm just so tempted, I'm like, I know I can hit them here. Just because you can. I mean, it does do 18% damage, and I... Actually, if he forward smashed me, I might have been dead there. Me, me Brawler's forward smash is ridiculous. It's like, why is it so strong? It might not have, though. Because I was at the other side of the stage. I was trying not to drift to the left. But sometimes when I'm just down airing at the ledge, like, there's a little bit of drift when I jump. And it's just like, ah, how annoying. Nowhere near the percent to die from that. I don't know if that would have killed. But yeah, I was being a little too uh, overconfident. As I usually am. <laughs> that side B was not safe. Uh, I want to use the, the side B so much. Oh. Actually, I think the forward tilt would have killed there. Wait, what? Oh, he died? Wait. Oh, he didn't even use the down B, did he? He might have made it back if he used the down B. <laughs> Uh, 
Yeah. I think that guy was just learning how to use me brawler. And also he probably didn't know how to fight Sephiroth. Alright. This Roy I fought a bunch. We were around evenly uh we were evenly matched for the most part. And this was the last match. I should have done a nair there. Oh well. Oh my god. Why am I doing all those up smashes and up airs? So bad. Because it leaves you vulnerable for a full second. I had a feeling that he was gonna like do a get up attack or neutral get up, so that's why I did this forward smash because I'm like. Even if he tries to like jump, like there's no way he can get me, so I might as well give it a shot. Why not? No, my percent, you ruined it. <laughs> oh yeah. He, this guy loves to counter me, so I got used to. Uh, Anytime I see someone countering a little too much, I love baiting it out. Ooh, if I held in the up B there, I actually probably would have killed him. I think that was my original plan, but I didn't do it right. He's... He needs to do like a jab or a forward tilt. This forward smash is too slow. I know it's so tempting, but when you're playing Roy, you gotta know. You can't always do the forward smash. And I learned Smash off of Marth, so I know exactly what it's like to want to do the, a smash all the time, because it's almost as fast as your tilt. It's ridiculous. Just knock him over. <laughs> Those mind games! Oh! <laughs> but yeah. This guy was similarly skilled to me. Oh, uh, I didn't realize that the last one was like a, an SD. But... It's just like... It was such a turnaround. Because I think one of the matches, he had two stocks by the end of it. So, from here on out, any of the matches with this Roy, I don't know, but like, pretty much I played this Roy, like, for like, a, like, an hour or two. So we played each other a lot. He was so fun to play. And that was when I learned that Neutral B has a much larger hitbox. Than I originally thought, because I thought it went nowhere. You know what? Now I'll have to go look, check the uh, melee and this one. <laughs> oh, yeah, and Smash 4. It sucks that Kuro Gain Hammer is, ex doesn't exist anymore, though. Because <laughs> that's like the only place I can find uh, Smash 4 frame data. I was paying attention real quick. He's spamming the, the side bees. <laughs> he needs to be careful with that. Don't rely on its power too much. I mean, I love using the, the side B as well. It's so easy to get rewarded for using it. But... It can be punishable. Like that. <laughs> Just shielding it makes it very hard for you to do anything because you're kind of locked in. And if you stop attacking, like, if the opponent's reaction time is fast enough, they'll be able to punish you. <laughs> I was just trying to get that up smash so, uh, 
I could catch him off guard. <laughs> Just overwhelmingly attack him with a bazillion moves. Oh. <laughs> and that's the problem I have. Oof. Air dodge. Oof. Such a shame. And like that, we're even done. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh yeah, the, the, the shadow flare, the side B. Still trying to get used to that. Because I think the shadow flare is like one of the more interesting things about Sephiroth. But, but I will not say this. A lot of people that I've seen just kind of don't even give a shit. They just kind of let it hit them. <laughs> it's like, you can't even scare people into shielding to break their shield because they all know that they don't want to get deer to death so everyone just lets it hit them now also that last stock ended so fast now the question is does Roy win this one I don't know Now the question is, yeah, you can see me doing some pretty bad mistakes. And just like that, he's dead. Sephiroth is light, and Roy hits like a truck. And there are, and there I am, like, adapting a little bit. I wanted it. But he still got hit by it anyways. Only the, the edge edge of it though. Oof, I wanted to hold it in. What's that on your toe? <laughs> Don't smash, I love it. And there I am, doing rising fares. You can't do that with Sephiroth. Roy's tall and you still can't do it with him. Hey. Oh, and I was a little too slow with that fare. Oof. The reason why I did that is like, backing out like that was the only thing he could really do. Because even if he countered, like, I don't think he could have done anything. Oof. Oh, okay. He he could have punished, but he panicked and jumped away. Oh, he timed it at just the right time. I wanted to break his shield, but he knows better. He can counter. A luxury that not every character has. <laughs> In hindsight, I probably should have like back thrown him. So I can have an easier time edge guarding him. Because Sephiroth's edge guard is like really ridiculous. Oof. <laughs> that <could hurt. laughs> spam. He got hit by it. He's like, no, I'm gonna keep on doing that, that combo. Oof. I was hoping he was gonna lay hang there a little bit longer. Because sometimes he was just hanging on there a little too long before. Oh. I had the right reads. <laughs> I tried to hop over him. Sephiroth's help does not go as far as I thought. But hey. Ended it out anyways. <laughs> Alright, is that the last Roy battle? I'm not sure. Three, oh, no. Because I don't know, like, how far back this goes. Wait, have they all been small battlefield? Maybe we both wanted it. Actually, I come to think of it, I don't think... Yeah, I think it was, like, small battlefield every time I fought this Roy on that day. My god. That counter lasts so long. 
Because I saw the counter and I thought it was dead. What happened to him? Did he not have his jump? <laughs> Yeah, he was trying to hit me with a forward smash, but I wanted to do something a little faster to catch him off guard. That's one thing I like about Sephiroth, it's like, he has like a little... He has pretty much a Meta Knight's dimensional cape, effectively. But it like hits so much farther. <laughs> I, I dodged the first attack, but he did the side key. He had the right read, he just did it way, way too late. And there we go. Oh fuck. <laughs> I love up there. But like, gosh darn, I need to... Stop using it so much. It's not safe. It's like one of the most unsafe moves you can do. That's one thing I like about uh, Sephiroth's uh, range. <laughs> Hit people outside of their counters. <laughs> We're both so afraid. <laughs> <laughs> we could have punished each other so many times. I mean, he's high percent on his last stock. But I'm Sephiroth, so I, I, I try not to get too close. <laughs> I knew he wanted it. Actually, I don't think I would have killed, even if I did do the up on him. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if that last hit would uh, broke my shield. Oh my god. He probably wanted that shield broken so bad. <laughs> oh my god. His shield got so tiny. But I am a little familiar with playing Roy, so I wasn't too afraid, so I kept on shielding. Ah, here we go. A new challenger. Or older challenger. DK. I don't remember how this goes. So I don't know who's gonna win. Okay, random parry. Well yeah, as you saw, I love doing the down air. I think this guy grabs me a, a, a crud ton, because I, I remember trying to counter him a few times, but he kept on grabbing me every time anyways. Oh, I saw that. The neutral B about to come out. Oh. Was it worth it, Donkey Kong? Was it worth it? <laughs> Oh, if I did the tilt, it probably would have broken the shield in time. Probably. I'm not sure. And you know what? It... Oh. Come on, man. Stop SD. At least he's charging his fists frequently. Yeah, here. I will say this: I'm not used to seeing Donkey Kong's actually use the the ground slam move. He probably thinks I'm trying to like shield it or something. And I'm just staying just outside his range. Actually, we'll uh, 
Will a dash attack kill me at this rate? I forget how strong his dash attack is. That up tilt though. I forgot that can kill. <laughs> yes. And that's one of my favorite things to do, but I'm really bad at timing that. Because that move is so much slower. I think it's because like I'm used to uh, spiking people with Link, which you have to do it like as soon as you're right next to the opponent. Oh. Uh, I think I was going to Ganondorf here. Oh my god! Just obliterate the stock. Oh my god. Gandalf is scary sometimes. Oh, I was too impatient. Jeez! The Doria! I've only taken 20%. I want it. Do I get it though? That's what I want to know. Yeah, I know. Let's go do the, the down B there. How does it end? Do I get this game inside? <laughs> He's edge guarding me a lot. Oh. Oh. <laughs> or he could just SD. <laughs> I mean, we all know he wasn't going to win that one. He got so destroyed. <laughs> uh. Alright. I remember right. This fox kicked my ass. So I think I might have lost this one really handily. Unless it. But I did fight this fox a few times, so this might be a good one. Hmm. I think. How did that not hit him? How did they not hit him? Did he even trade? What? Yeah, I'm being so impatient. <laughs> and then my... Con I think my controller got stuck there, so I didn't move at all. Let's if I get, like, some crazy comeback, which I doubt. Oh! You, I did not want that forward tail, for sure. I knew I wanted the, the Nair. It would have hit, too. It was tempting to do the, the gain inside there, but, like, I'm down to stock. Not a good trade. And I, I wouldn't have died there if I didn't reactively, I mean, like, reflexively double jump. Is he gonna face stop me? I mean, he's in kill percent right now. That was a missing point. Oh my god, I was playing terribly this round. <laughs> He three stalked me, <laughs> but I was playing so bad that round. That is such a difference compared to the Mario one, where I kept on reading him constantly. I think I was feeling very impatient because recently I was just losing my patience with everything. Hopefully this one goes better, because 
I usually don't say the, the three stocks very often. <laughs> it's usually either to be like, oh hey, that person that I fought. <laughs> like, I actually got a three stock on them. <laughs> or, I got wrecked so hard, I need to go figure out what was going on. Oof! I meant to s slightly move forward, then do the fourth smash because it would cover the whole s uh, platform, but I didn't do it right. Oof. Oh, I wanted it! I want the cannon side. That cannon side should have worked. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't think that's what I wanted to do at all. Oh, I. Sometimes I think it'll just stop it. Boom. A lot of people have a hard time teching that, especially on Wi-Fi. <laughs> you should have done your jab. <laughs> I was expecting him to go forward and do like a smash attack or a tilt or something. I love the delayed reactions sometimes. It's just like, are you really charging against me right now? Are you really charging? Slap! <laughs> oh, I didn't have a double jump. Okay. I thought I had a double That's weird. I should have held shield there. And I thought that would snap the ledge. <laughs> Oh, side B, huh? <laughs> oh, did I do the forward tilt? I should've just done jab. Ooh, oh, I get the last... Oh! Am I gonna get another stock on him, though? Oh. He could have up smashed you there, probably. Then again, he a heavy boy. Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho! You better make sure your spacing's proper. Oh. I, I want the comeback, but I don't think that's what happens. There I go again, with the double jumps. Huh. I know that's like such a bad thing to do, is to double jump immediately back. I wonder why I do that sometimes. Oh! That would have been end of the game right there, if I hit that. I used... This... Oh my god. We're both in kill percent. You can't kill from a throw, right? Oh, I did the jump! Oh, the punch. Oh my god! What are these interactions? Oh! The comeback! 216%! Are you serious? Oh my god, I love watching Ganondorf. <laughs> no, I didn't lose! What are, you, what, are you, what are you playing? The Fox Locks! <laughs> Maybe I did in this one though. Because this was a Fox that is quite fast. It's hard to deal with fast characters when you're as slow as Ganondorf. He's much faster in this game, though. I will say that. <laughs> Didn't expect him to go past me. Oh my god.
Almost. Hey, I hit him finally. Hmm. Would jumping and doing a dare be better there? Oh! Oh! He tried to tech it. He teched it, but buffered an air dodge. <laughs> Because that's a hard thing to tech when you have that little distance that you can tech. Oh! What? Oh. Shouldn't I be able to do a dash attack there? Hmm. Well, if I... That's one thing I'll have to look. I have to look at Ganondorf's frame data more. But like... He's not like a character I plan on maining or anything. He's just kind of like a character I just like to screw around with. Oh no! Oh! I know what happened there. I'm like, I can do the forward air there. And then like, as I was going to do the forward air, I went too far away and I panicked and I did it anyways, thus leading to SD. I got noivous. question is, do I make it back from this? Probably not. Definitely not. <laughs> yeah. That might have been like the first match against that fox and I'm like, oh shit, a fox that's actually fast and knows what they're doing? I'm not used to this. Because I'm so used to being able to just like outrange foxes because they don't know how to use their speed to their advantage. Oh, that wasn't the first match. Oh hey, this has platforms. Oh, I can't believe that didn't hit. His sword is so massive, though. I thought he was going to drift in a little more. Alright, this... Looking at this, this looks more like a, a first match sort of thing, because he's making a, a lot of mistakes against me. <laughs> You're a little far away there, buddy. Get a little closer. Uh oh. Let me just uh, face palm here for a second. I don't know why I did that. I I even remember when I was playing that. I regretted that so bad. I'm like, why did I do that? <laughs> I think maybe my plan was to like fastball and then. Side B, but my fingers were like, eh, eh, now. <laughs> so, I think that's what happened. Because I can get noivous. Yeah, because, like, I think a few of these later uh, replays, like, I had a horrible, horrible diet, and it was making me so impatient so frequently that it made it hard for me to play. I'm not having an easier time because I'm not eating the gosh darn chocolate and such. <gasps> oh no, he made it back. The gain inside didn't work. <laughs> I can't believe I made it back. I thought I wouldn't. The rising fares. Interesting. Um, wait, hold up. <laughs> no, I can't do Gain inside there. <laughs> he has another stop. <laughs> but yeah, I realize he's always trying to do the down smash against me. I don't know if that works against Gandorf because Gandorf has a very low hang. So you can't, I don't think you can just down smash against Gandorf there. Oh! Up here didn't work. Oh! Oh! Oh, dang. That door, y'all. 
It's so... Oh my god, games are feel so cheesy sometimes. I feel like I should have done a few more inter neutral interactions before winning that. He was so low. Oh my god. But Fox is like one of the lightest characters. Wait a minute. Is it me or is he playing a lot slower? <laughs> I think it's... Oh! He actually saved me there. You know I want it. Oh, you can't do that. <laughs> You have too many rapid Oh my god. Now, I know the forward smash can hit below the ledge, but I don't know where it can do that. Oof. Oh, I should... Next time that happens, I'm gonna have to remember to do a side B there, because it's like, if you're already dead, you might as well do that. If I ever get this matchup again. <laughs> and now it's just me messing up. Or not? Read the roll. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. You almost had the, the percent. They're shooting me with one more laser. <laughs> then we both would have been at the, the best percent. <laughs> I mean, he was at the best percent for a while, at least. <laughs> no. Don't down smash like that. Uh oh. Heavy boy. Oh! You had such a huge window. You fool! No way. Oh my god. Fox is so light. I am... I am over 100% damage. There's a little bit of rage. <laughs> Not as insane as Smash 4, but there still is rage. <laughs> oh. I think I'm getting out of here. Oh yeah, I am. I don't play normal Inkling. Play the green one. Aw. You went a little higher than I was expecting. Oh my god. Just just absolutely wreck him. <laughs> Zero to death. I love it. Is Ganondorf too fast for you? <laughs> No, but but my my gain inside, my gain inside though. <laughs> <laughs> oh. By the way, I tried playing Inkling the other day. And I didn't realize how crazy their damage is. It's like, I always assumed that they had like low damage because <laughs> freaking they're a very fast character with two ways to use projectiles. But holy crud, their damage racks up so fast. Yeah, and I I, I played them recently because Splatoon 3 was announced. They are a character that I want to play, but they are kind of a tricky character. <laughs> there it is, the game inside. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, wait, what? Oh, another one against this guy. T 
I gotta say, every time I forward smash a shield, I'm just like... I'm like, I'm going to attack it again and break it the next time. Because, I will be honest, I get away with that a little too much. Holy crud! He almost has me dead. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Oof! Two BS things back to back for that player. Oh, oh, that's disgusting. Shield pushback. Don't forget it. Oh, I was too slow. Oh, oh no! <laughs> finally, finally, someone catches me for doing offstage shenanigans. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> hey, the homie stock. My question is, will I beat them? Because that's one thing I've realized is like, I'm 50 50 on homie stocking because sometimes I'm like, I want to be polite to the other opponent, but at the same time, the better I get at Smash, the more I realize... Oh my god. <laughs> I thought I could get through it. I thought I could muscle through it. But no. Anyways, the more, I, the better I get, the more I realize, um... Oh! That spaced bag air. Nice. I love it. I felt so good doing that. Anyways. The more, the better I get... The more I realize homie stocks, <laughs> you probably shouldn't do that because the, the other opponent can always turn it back immediately. <laughs> oh my gosh, I actually played a few. I mean, I really love fighting Inkling. It's so fun because they're always so fast. And if you watch out for the roller, like, they have. They can't really do many cheesy things, so I I always have a fun time. <laughs> I'll just uh, wait for you to throw that grenade real quick. Every time I hear the the inkling throw the the bomb, it always makes me think of the the item toss and goof troop. It's like the same sound effect. I like this incoming player. I mean, to be fair, like... <laughs> I feel like... I don't know. I, I generally just like fighting them. Like, pretty much every inkling player I've played is just really cool. <laughs> oh <laughs> for a second there I'm like what am I doing and I wasn't paying attention to the percents there's only one thing a Ganondorf wants to do <laughs> oh he actually got me first Ooh. <laughs> this offstage gameplay. Oh. <laughs> that up smash is a little delayed. <laughs> Just a little. Ooh. That knocked back. Where's your edge guard, man? Ooh. I read that roller. I don't know if I read it in the game, but I saw that comment. I'm like, the spacing, well, the positioning, yeah, it's gonna happen. Oh! I don't think I would have hit the down air. 
But the forward air is a lot more forgiving because I think the forward air stays out for a long, lot longer. So that's why I went for that. <laughs> the big meaty forward air. Oh my god, another one. <laughs> well, like I said before, I like fighting Inkling. <laughs> I'm just having a fun time watching this, okay? <laughs> nope. Yeah, I hear. The <laughs> wait for the shield to drop. <laughs> Oh, oh, uh, okay. <laughs> that was awkward. Cause there's a, a ginormous amount of end lag when they recharge their ink like that. It's ridiculous. But I just was in end lag of my. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, so bad. Oh, oh no! Oh. Oh my god, still not dead. Because low percent. Still not. Oh, dang it. Oh my god. <laughs> dead now, for sure. No! And the upbeat didn't grab him. But yeah, Gandorf, big heavy boy. I'm not used to being heavy characters. Probably like the heaviest character I play would be Ridley. Sometimes Rob, but I don't practice Rob. <laughs> Rob's so easy to play. Oh. oh man, this is just a little faster. <laughs> I will say, I do... That was just me testing to see if the sword would be far enough away. But yeah. Anyways, I love King Kirul's theme in this. It's so fun. Oh, that's death. Wait. Forgot. Gandorf, big boy. He didn't die. I play so many glass cannony characters. <laughs> Boom, you're dead. Unteckable, probably. Pretty sure I saw red there. Oh, you know what I want? You know what I want? What I really, really want? Oh! Yeah! Oh! That would have been a perfect time for the side B. <laughs> Not death. I think it's because I got scared earlier that I drifted away, but I kind of forgot about that. So I messed it up. You can't re grab like that. Don't re grab like that against me. I will. I will punish it. I love punishing that. I have such a fun time doing that. And I just run off and do the the back air a lot of the time because a lot of the time it'll be unteckable and it's really easy to do but there are better ways because you can trump and then do a back air or you can just with Ganondorf you can just spike people when they're there Toon Link huh My brain is telling me that this was a bad Toon Link, but he's kicking my ass right now. <laughs> what? Oh, 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 okay. Interesting interaction. I think he was thinking about doing the down air there. Hey. Funny how we get the, the Splatoon stage after we're done with the, the Inkling stuff. Ah, oh, if I didn't charge it for so long, he would have been dead. 
I saw that. He wanted to forward smash me there. If I did anything else, he probably would have hit me. Oh, right. This guy s spams the forward smash trying to kill me. You can't do that. You can't do that. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Yes. Gain insights. They would be happy. <laughs> You can freaking mash out of Ganon's sides, by the way. No one ever does. No one ever does. <laughs> I mean, you can mash out of Ganon's sides at low percents, which I love going for Ganon's sides at low percents. I mean, that opponent's at low percent, I should say. <laughs> I destroy you with my massive sword. <laughs> oh, please let me win with this percent. Yes! <laughs> the best percent to finish off at. <laughs> I think that up to was accidental. Gandorf just wanted to <laughs> show off the goods there. Oh, whoops. Oh, dang it. I meant to press A. Oh, what a fool. Anyways, I wanted to see how far we are. How far are we at? So we are about about halfway. About halfway. Oh, so we get to play another one. Boom. I forget which stage this is. I don't really care. <laughs> also, I did see Palutena. I never play Palutena. I might have though. I I have played her a few times, of course. She's really easy. Palutena, you can just throw out anything you want. Ness is kind of like that too. You just throw out anything you want and it just freaking works. And it leads into other things as well. <laughs> Rather even. Oh! Oof, the two whiffs. The two whiffs. That up air is so ridiculous. It's... It's very hard to punish Ganondorf's up air. Comes out really quick. Rather low end lag. Covers a ton of distance. Covers everything around him. It's so good. Yeah, I, I back rolled because of the boomerang. If I, if I was feeling gutsy, what I could have done is I could have just grabbed and then threw him immediately. But I didn't think I would have the time. Oh my god, he's dead already? Oh, you know what I'm... You, you see what I'm fishing for, right? <laughs> it's that, it's that game inside. Come here, bro. Don't it, don't even punish it, it just stands there. <laughs> oh, I wanted it. The warlock punch. Nope. You gotta hold it longer. You could have broken the shield. But I was just waiting for it. Oh. Interesting. I guess there is a lot of, like, shield lag after dropping your shield. Oh, I was expecting him not to go on the platform. What a strange idea, though, because... With the position that Gandorf is, he has to do the down air if he wanted to, like, hit Link. But, like... Like, if he goes onto the platform, I can hit him with a fair or a nair, which are very... are kind of safe, especially the nair. The nair is ridiculous. <laughs> That's such a bad down air. I probably want to hit him in the air. Oof. 
Well, think about that forward smash. It's like, even if he... He should not have rolled in like that. Because he was in range. If he rolled away, maybe I would have hit him with like a nair or a fair. But, you know what is a lot more damaging than those? A forward smash. <laughs> Don't do that. Oh boy. Probably lose this one. Palutena is very hard because all of her moves are ridiculously good. She is like one of the worst characters in Smash 4, but she got buffed so hard that she's like one of the best in this game. It's like from being too slow to do anything to being the fastest, like one of the fastest in the game. It's like, what? What? <laughs> My reaction times aren't the best sometimes. Oof. What the... Ugh. Slow reaction times. Back air on shield is safe, if I remember right. Oh, I tried to air dodge through that. I know that for sure. I remember that. Oh, it's so annoying. I don't know how we missed each other. Whatever. Oh. That stalling momentum from the teleport was just enough to not die. <laughs> Can't believe that didn't reach her. I think I'm getting a little too uh, greedy for the, the kills there. Oh my god. Yeah, I was getting way too greedy for the kills. Also that up tilt was... If you ever see an up tilt from a Ganondorf, it's probably a miss input. <laughs> I got confused there. I thought I was on the left, but no. I got something right. Down B so good. Oh, why did I do that? I think I wanted to go past her, but I panicked and did it too early. Alright, fine. I'll go over here then. <laughs> That's basically what happened there. Stop that. Oof. Oh my god. Our medical. I hate our medical. It's not a whole lot of damage, but it just like stuns your mo momentum. Oh, not killed yet. Do I get one more kill though? I don't think I do. I'll just go low. Oh, the slow reaction time. Oof, those mind games. <laughs> How did I not get hit by that first up smash? <laughs> There's no way I win this, right? <laughs> There's no way- yeah, okay, there we go. I was gonna say... 150% against Palutena. I have a very bad record against fighting Palutena. Palutena and Zelda are very hard for me to fight because their hitboxes are so huge. 
They may be slower than some characters, but they're still pretty fast. They got combos and damage, they got it all. <laughs> well, the thing is better, of course. And this Diddy was absolutely nuts. Look at this guy. I tried to do this again inside there because I realized he's, he was kicking my butt. I need to like recenter myself. Because that would make. Because mental damage is a thing. <laughs> eh. Because some. Anytime you do a Ganon sight against somebody, like, you'll see the mental effects on it. Huh? Fair, not hit him. I think it will hit anyways. <laughs> oh, a little too late on that up forward smash. Whew. I know this isn't a three stock, but my gosh. Diddy Kong is absolutely ridiculous. Isn't this the same skin that, like, Zero uses a lot of the time? Oh, ho, ho. I totally forgot that I did that. <laughs> I kind of actually really like that. I'm gonna start doing that more. <laughs> that almost worked. Oh, get out of here. That also went a lot farther than I expected it to. I thought he wouldn't make it. <laughs> I wasn't sure if he was going to do one of those things where like, he becomes passive. <laughs> the parry. Oh. Oh, I, it's not a reverse, is it? Uh oh, uh oh, because I'm pretty sure he finishes this with an up smash. Uh oh, oh, <laughs> that, that double jump. I'm I can't believe I panic like that. No! No, he, he does that. I've only seen people doing that like this past month. People never did that before, but then someone made like a video of a Diddy Kong constantly using up B like crazy. And people have started doing it. I'm not actually that dark midnight. <laughs> I'm actually the Gandor. So, you know, you don't usually get to see Meta Knight, so you know I had to record it. And me destroying him. <laughs> he probably turns it back, because that's the thing. Gandorf is pretty garbage off stage. It's like if Meta Knight gets Gandorf off stage, like he can absolutely destroy Gandorf. Because <laughs> Meta Knight's so good off stage. He's the reason why I go off stage in the first place. Because you can just pressure people safely with Meta Knight. I don't have to do a whole lot. My god. Of course, Gandorf is a very heavy boy. He hits very hard. He, the Meta Knight player, has to play so hard in order to do anything. Is it a three stock? Oh, 
Careful, buddy. You almost didn't space it right. <laughs> Oh, I thought he was going to go on the other side for some reason. Oh, I remember that I was repositioning the controller in my hand and I accidentally pressed the, the, the left uh, shield button. <laughs> the left shoulder button. There we go. Oh, my poor Meta Knight. I felt so bad. I'm like, he got so destroyed. And I SD'd. He didn't even get the satisfaction of taking a stock. I just SD my own stock. Ugh. Oh boy. Jigglypuff. Always a terror. What the heck? <laughs> um. As I was saying, usually a very terrifying foe to face because. They can just hang just outside of your range and just wait for you to do a move or just flat out hit you because the aerial drift is so good. <laughs> that second shield is not purpose. I just can't get over Gandorf's raw power. <laughs> if I did the side B earlier, I don't know. That probably wouldn't have worked. I was probably dead there. Like, what is Gandorf supposed to do against Jigglypuff when off the stage? I think the first time I did that, I didn't know if it was gonna, like, grab. But that second time, I definitely grabbed because I knew it was gonna work. Yep. Oh, he thought he could rest me. I think he still beats me though. <laughs> God damn, I'm not playing with the Super Mario Brothers 3 now. This music is so ingrained into my brain because I played it so many times when I was a kid. Super Mario World, not so much, but I did play it quite a bit with my friends. Uh, boom! The door, yeah. <laughs> oh boy. As I get distracted. That sword is ridiculous. It's so ridiculous. It's so powerful. Oh. <clears throat> I. A lot of Pokemon trainers I've been fighting will just stick to one Pokemon for the entire duration. I don't know if this is one of those, though. I have- oh, no! Already swapping to the Ivysaur, so this is not one of them. <laughs> I didn't even land a single hit on him. Gandorf's a big heavy boy. Also, I, I saw like a guide re <laughs> I don't even care. I'm pretty sure I lost this one, but like getting two Ganon sights on someone is basically a win. <laughs> it's like that should never happen. Oh my god. <laughs> you really are you, are you serious? You really gotta get inside twice. If, if I... No, I, I can't do another game inside. This is my last stop. I might go for it though, anyways. <laughs> Just to be like, I get inside all three of your stocks. Uh-oh. I don't know why, but a lot of Ivysaurs have a hard time da timing the, the down air. Uh oh, that's death. Oh! Oh, okay. <laughs> I forgot that they can swap so fast. <laughs> if they stayed Ivysaur, they would be dead. <laughs> Charizard's up B. I don't think his up B 
went as far in Smash 4 as well. Oh, I remember this one. I remember how this one ends. I like how this one ends. <laughs> but also, Ridley. But the character that I like to say that I accidentally named. Because I, I love playing him casually and competitively, so he has like the most time. Except for like the characters that like I force myself to go play to like get better at. I just naturally love playing Ridley. Also, like for years, like I was waiting for Ridley to get in the Smash. And we got in Smash. I lost my freaking shit. <laughs> because I was like, no freaking way. And not only was he really fun, his trailer was awesome. And his gameplay is so fun. I love it. I'm a little distracted. I, I just was having fun nostalgia with like, Ridley's reveal and such. But yeah. I think this Ridley's a little better than me, especially since. I think I didn't play uh, Gandorf that much. I think this was like one of my earlier ones. Oh, not enough time for the four tilt. Oh my god. So brutal. Down air to up smash. How much damage is that? Ooh, he tried to wobble feign me. Why did he messed up? And not only that, he also SD'd. How could you? Doing mistakes like that could cost you the game. Oh, let's not do too strong of a punish. <laughs> Got greedy. I think Gans Dorf is really freaking heavy. If he waited a little longer, he would have gotten me. Oh, free punish there. <laughs> he missed. <laughs> what was I doing there? Was I going for the cancer? Oh, here we go. Nope. Your get up isn't that long. He was very close. He just like a couple inches away, but I play Ridley a lot. I know I know the get up attack range. I'm like, I'm just gonna keep on holding. I'm curious to see what you do. Cause like if he jumps, I can still get him. He can't really do the projectile. It's like he could probably Go away and fade back in with a fair, and that's probably the best thing you can do. Ah oh, yes, I'm the Pichu here. <laughs> Love playing Pichu. Every time I play Pichu, it makes me happy. Don't know what it is. But yeah, I love playing both these characters. Because I love playing underdog characters. Little Mac is a better representation of an underdog, but like, Pichu takes a close second. I love playing him. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't know. <laughs> I shouldn't have done the, the upbeat into the stage, because it was not <laughs> a good idea. Ooh. An immediate side B. And I did the second one because I want to make sure. Uh oh. Yep. I'm not good enough at the recovery yet. Oh my god. Just grab him. Uh oh. KO. <laughs> Baited. Oh my god. Stop forward smashing. That might kill Pichu at this percent though. <laughs> he is the lightest character in the game. Oh, just slightly out of reach. <laughs> Winner, 
any match with Little Mac goes by really fast. <laughs> Unless if you're like camping him like crazy and he's being very patient, it's gonna go fast. And these are both characters that are very light. And have a lot of damage. Oof. Oof. I haven't even touched him yet. There we go. I did it? Yeah. Oh, that was the first time apparently. I think I, I think I tried to go a little low though. But oh! He went a little farther than I thought. Uh oh. <laughs> he dodged. I gotta stop doing the getting jab with Pichu. Why was I doing that? Why am I jabbing with Pichu? It's not safe. It's not safe at all. Especially since I think uh, Little Mac has a frame one jab. So if Pichu jabs, like he'll he, wait. Unless Pichu's too too short. I don't know. Little Mac's really little. I wanted to go lower than that. Oh boy. Yeah, this is me trying to learn Pichu, by the way. Oh, that's not a... That's not a spike, but we'll take it. We'll pretend that was a spike. What the fuck? Oh my... He's spamming so hard. Bro. We've done that too many times, bro. Why didn't he grab the ledge? Does the KO punch not let you grab the ledge? I think he might have learned that that match. What the heck? Why did, you should be you think you'd be able to grab the ledge after that, right? One, go. Oh dear. Oh. <laughs> he held that way, way too long. I just grabbed him out of reaction. God. What is this little Mac? Is this just like a a traditional Wi-Fi little Mac. Yeah, here. Oh, you need Pikachu. You don't have the range for that. What? I hit him, but it didn't trigger the counter. He probably countered like immediately after the first hit, and the other hits didn't get him. Hey, I got it that time. <laughs> Deleted. <gasps> oh no. If you're good with the recovery of the teleports, you can make it, but I'm, I haven't like grinded that out, so I'm not good at that. Well, it's like, Pichu's just single teleport is just way better than so many characters' to, uh, recoveries as is. <laughs> it's like, you don't really need a second teleport, but oh my god. What? How'd that knock at him? Oof. Oh my god, he recovers so fast from that. <laughs> I held that in. Oh, I thought he had another stock. Oh dang. But yeah, baiting up that side B. 
That side B is very reliable for getting people off you. You kind of have to do it, because if you don't do it, people will just knock you away. But once people start baiting that out, like, what are you going to be able to do there? Ooh, I like this. This match starts off a lot more spicy. No! Oh, hey, I made it. Oh, <laughs> I tried to hit him. Ooh. I think this was the first match. Oh my god, this music. I want to play Pikmin now. Sprung was playing Smash. It makes me want to play everything. Ho ho ho! The extra long wait. What? 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 Wait, how did I not grab him? And why didn't he react? Like, what? It's like, I don't even think that was a sidestep. It's just like, it didn't... What? Alright then. Oh my god, this smash is... Has he even done a single tilt? I want to know. <laughs> Wait, did that? No, that didn't stop him from doing it, did it? I'm pretty sure that has armor. Ooh. I, my gut was telling me to do the side B there. But I'm glad I didn't do that in the in the game. That's death. <laughs> I love Pichu so much. I mean, Lucario has a crawl too, but I don't know. His crawl's a little. It just looks weird and funny. go underneath him so I can like not get hit but I don't know if that's actually a thing you can do against little max like side B oof oh I can hit that that way am I gonna win because of that oh Nice uppercut. Oh my god, what a way. We ran out of time? Was that like a short timer or something? Because it was doing his rule set. Because I usually have like the later rule sets because it's so easy to run out of time. Wait, running out of time on a little Mac match? What the heck? Oh, I see. Three minutes. That's like half. It's like less than half the time of my, my my thing. That's giving you a minute for each stock. That's ridiculous. <laughs> oh, I sidestepped it. Come on, man. I was so far in the air. You really expect me to land immediately like that? <laughs> I mean, I am getting hit by his smashes, though. <laughs> I'm just gonna walk away from you. I don't care that you're punching, charging your punch. I will notice this. I haven't been doing the, the forward tilts. I'm probably not, like, confident in my spacing. But you got you kind of have to if you're playing Pichu. Because you have to be 
like rubbing up against an opponent with most of the attacks. Aww, come on, man! You gotta charge up all the way so I can throw you off the stage. <laughs> Wait, was that a second KO punch from that star? <laughs> oh dang! Oh, I only dodged that forward smash because I pancaked. Oh my god. I think this is why I saved this, because I realized after a while... I realized the patterns I had to do, because I knew this was just a, a scrubby little Mac. I adapted over time. Is that like the first one? Was that the first match? And then I'm like, no. I'm going to learn the habits. I'm not going to die from him. That's so strange that he three stalked me. But yeah, uh, I guess over time I I adapted to him, but he didn't adapt to me. Cause he just what the heck is going on? Ah, uh, what? Huh? These moves. Um. What? Okay. Okay. I think this is one of those matches where... <laughs> Wait. Oh, I, I think I'm the set for off then. <laughs> that seems like something I do. Okay, I remember now. I remember now. This Mario is pretty bad. So I decided to go... Put toy with him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I can't snap that well. <laughs> How? <laughs> How does Sephiroth do it? <laughs> I guess you have to be genetically modified to snap as well as he does. Get the sparkles going everywhere. <laughs> or make great fa flavored Skittles, clearly. <laughs> oh my gosh. Down here? No? <gasps> I resisted the urge! <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> what the? <laughs> this is so dumb. Oh my god. What? <laughs> Ooh. Those shadow flares do hurt. Cheering for Mario. Wait, what? Oh, did I have to leave? Wait, what? Why did I? Oh, I probably had to leave. Cause that's. I think that's why I charged the the Giga Play. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I was. I was like, just kill me. Just reflect this back at me, please. Alright, so how bad was this Mario actually? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, this is also a match that, like, 
Mario struggles with because Mario struggles with sorties and Sephiroth has a really large sword. <laughs> I do gotta uh, say, I do gotta get better at SDIing uh, combos. Oops. I didn't jump. <laughs> yeah. Masterful gameplay. <laughs> Don't you just love it when you're fighting your opponent and you both just grab the wrong way? Did I do multiple matches against this guy? I think I'm... yeah, I, this definitely isn't my first one. I'm probably screwing around still. Oh dang! Last stop though. Uh oh. something to show you. It's a... I thought of a gift. I want the science! Fireball! <laughs> uh, I have to go listen to Sephiroth's voice. Oh! Spike! Oh dang! Maybe I saved that one because he actually made it come back. Cause I was, go you could see me goofing off there. Three, two, oh no! Ah, oh, bummer. Ah, uh, I guess I didn't save uh, one of the ones where I was kicking his butt. That's that's a shame. All right, this time I'm the Mario though, fighting a Ridley. Well, at least I think so. Unless if like something Doom related got announced. I don't usually use the the red Ridley. Nah, nah. That seems like my Mario. Yeah. I mean, well the fair spank is definitely any Mario. If you play Mario, you can't you can't resist the fair. Like, aw, I try to extend the combo. But I'm not used to Mario, so I did a little too late. Oh my god. Dude, Mario. Oh my god! This poor Ridley. Oh my god. Oh. No. <laughs> no. Do I do a third one? Oh no no he did that. Oh, not death yet. Oh <laughs> no three stock. <laughs> I try to avoid it. Why are you doing the side? Oh yeah, that's right. Ridley doesn't die with with his supposed Ridley side, because he can just stage by people. And I think that would be effective against Mario because Mario's vertical recovery isn't the greatest, it's decent. Oh, interesting. Back air. No choice. I mean, Ridley's so big, I probably was like, I'm confident in this. Oh my god! Did I really go that deep? <laughs> Wait, all three of those kills were the fair spike, weren't they? Oh my god. I just couldn't resist. <laughs> that poor red leg. Hey, it's Bowser. <laughs> my gosh. Guys are so fast. I would have laughed if he SD'd there. But that is like a thing that Bowser's can do. Just grab on to a ledge like that. Ooh! That's one of the things I, I have to I struggle with is Bowser's forward smash. 
Because everything else is pretty short. But oh, that forward smash, though. Oh. That would have been sweet. Oh my god, these moves! Oh, I was just like a little earlier. Okay, hit me with one of your many KO moves, bro. There you go. <laughs> Air dodge is undoing <laughs> to the ledge. Hey, I got it. I finally got it. He likes grabbing me a lot. Oh, yeah, that's right. Be okay, be gay. <laughs> Something tells me he's not used to people delaying their get ups. <laughs> Oh my god! Mario has some cool shit sometimes, I gotta say. That's why it's fun to play. Oh. And then that thing. Now that's the reason why it's not fun to play. His range is so goddamn short. But if you can play around the range, oh my god, it feels amazing. Oh. Oof. Yeah. A lot of end lag on that. And it's frame 15 forward smash, I believe. Basically, Mario's forward smash is unreactable with the way ultimate is. Alright. I can only shield it so much. Oh, I had the right idea. The jab spam? The ultimate mind games. <laughs> Me? Fishing for a fair spike? No. Get out of town. Yeah, here, bro. Come on, man. I so bathe. <laughs> And that's something I gotta get better at. It's like, you know you can punish most Bowsers by just being underneath them because you know they're either gonna wanna do the down B or the down A. Oh, is that it? Oh. I was having such a fun time. Oh. Uh, I, I had a blast looking back at these replays. It's so fun. It's so funny the things that I think people can do. But well, all these are getting deleted in a couple days. Well, I I gotta say though, th these two matches, these these were a little underwhelming because I don't have the original where I kicked his butt to make it to show like why I was goofing around so hard. <laughs> and Mario was so bad. <laughs> oh well, but yeah, that was fun. Alright. And then I'll probably play Pyron Mithra again in a couple days. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. I can't imagine myself maining them. But, uh, especially since I haven't played Xenoblade Chronicles 2 or even seen a playthrough of it, so I don't know anything about the characters. But hey, the gameplay looks really fun, but you know what? A lot of characters in Smash I really love playing. So, yeah. That was an hour and 40 minutes. Oh boy. If I had the time to go edit all of this stuff and just do like my favorite bits, I would do that. But you know what? There's a lot of other things I gotta do. So, yeah. Farewell. Hope you had fun. I definitely had fun. <laughs>